free to use by schools and teaching institutions. This video can be freely used by any school or institute for teaching purposes. We only ask that you recommend us to the pupils parents and other schools. We believe that education should be freely available to all. Thank you. Properties of quadrilaterals The word quadrilateral comes from quadri, which means four, and lateral which means sides. So quadrilateral are shapes with four angles and four sides. They are a quite a lot of quadrilaterals to learn about. Before we start to look at any shapes, we must go over some of the symbols used in the drawings. We have covered these symbols in naming conventions used with lines video. Look at figure 1, as an example. This is a drawing of a square. Normally, corners of shapes are labeled with a capital letter, so that we can talk about the angle. We can refer to the angle by this letter like this, angle B, see figure 1. A little square is used at line intersections, corners to show that the angle is a right angle or night symbols like vertical small lines on a line shape show that these lines are of same length in this case there are four lines of same length symbols like a single greater than sign or two greater than sign on a line signify that these lines are parallel ie AB is parallel to DC because they both have the same symbol and same is true for AD which is parallel with BC Important properties of quadrilaterals are that the angles always add to 360 degree. Properties of a square A square is an equilateral, whose all sides are of the same size and all angles are right angles or 90 degrees, see figure 2. Length properties All sides of a square are always equal in length. That is AB, BC, CD that are all equal in length. Parallel properties. Line AB is parallel to CD and AD is parallel to BC. Angle properties. Angle AA, angle B, angle C and angle D are all right angle. Angle AA plus angle B plus angle C plus angle D equals 360 degree. Properties of a rectangle A rectangle is an equilateral whose opposite side are of the same length and all angles are right angles or 90 degrees, see figure 3. Length properties Side, AB is equal in length to DC, but are not equal to AC or BC. Side, AD is equal in length to BC, but are not equal to AB or DC. Parallel properties Line AB is parallel to CD, and AD is parallel to BC. Angle properties. Angle AA, Angle B, Angle C and Angle D are all right angle. Angle AA plus Angle B plus Angle C plus Angle D equals 360 degree. Properties of a parallelogram. A parallelogram is an equilateral whose opposite sides are the same size, and are also in parallel to each other, figure 4, and their opposite angles, are also the same size. It looks like a rectangle whose sides have been pushed to one side. Length properties. Side AB, is equal in length to DC, but are not equal to AC or BC. Side AD, is equal in length to BC, but are not equal to AB or DC. Parallel properties. Line AB is parallel to CD, and AD is parallel to BC. Angle properties. Angle AA plus angle B equals 180 degrees and angle C plus angle D equals 180 degrees. Angle AA equals angle C and angle B equals angle D. Angle AA plus angle B plus angle C plus angle D equals 360 degree. Properties of a rhombus A rhombus 
is an equilateral, whose all sides are the same, a bit like a square, except the angles are not 90 degrees, see figure 5. Length properties. All sides of the rhombus are equal in length. That is AB, BC, CD, that are all equal. Parallel properties. Line AB is parallel to CD and AD is parallel to BC. Angle properties. Angle AA plus angle B equals 180 degrees and angle C plus angle D equals 180 degrees. Angle AA equals angle C and angle B equals angle D. Angle AA plus angle B plus angle C plus angle D equals 360 degree. Properties of a trapezium. A trapezium is an equilateral, whose all sides are not the same size. See figure 6. Length properties. All sides of a trapezium are not equal in length. Parallel properties. Line AD is parallel to BC. Line AD is called the top base and line BC is called the bottom base. Angle properties. Angle AA plus angle B plus angle C plus angle D equals 360 degree. We hope you have learned something from this video. Please tell at least 5 people about our work, so they can also benefit. Do visit our website, to see hundreds of free educational videos. This is the end of this lesson. Thank you for watching this video. We regularly bring out new videos, so don't miss out. Please subscribe to get these educational videos.